All right, this is a sixth generation Subaru Impreza RS, which arrives with nine new changes worth considering. And that is what I'm going to align here. Briefly add in trim differences in prices and which trim you should be targeting if you are turning charts. But prior to that, allow me to highlight what the 2024 model year Subaru Impreza is about in a few words, guys. Now, the 2024 Subaru Impreza showcases a notable evolution in its exterior design. I believe you guys agree. If you haven't, look at the footage. This has been out there for a while. This vehicle has been out there for a while. And we can all attest to the fact that it has departed from the previous generation's angular and square style. Right? This new Impreza embraces smoother lines in a more fluid overall aesthetic look resulting in a more sophisticated and contemporary look. Now, the aesthetic appeal will be left to each and every one to decide. And on this note, I welcome all of you to Autostop once again. Let's get down to the business of being here. And one of the very positive notes is that the RS version that we are getting for the Impreza boasts attractive two-tone sports seats and don the red that I would like to highlight here before I continue. So yes, take a look. It makes it look sporty, right? So this adds a touch of sportiness and enhances the interior presentation of this vehicle. When you get down beneath the steering wheel, there is a metallic pedal and footrest further contributing to the overall aesthetic appeal of the interior of this vehicle. Again, let me highlight the fact that the infotainment system that you're looking at is an 11.6 inch touchscreen which remains relatively user friendly although it is considered simplistic in terms of menu presentation and functions. Now, this supports that, 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 that I'm going to talk about by the nine, and there are USB A and USB C connections available. Take a look at the center console layout. It has been revised, I'm sure you all agree, and that provides a slightly more practical arrangement in the cabin of the RS Impreza that we are getting. So, in terms of engine options, the 2024 Impreza offers two choices. Does the base and convenience touring trims come with the older 2.0 liter flat four engine delivering 152 horsepower and 145 pound feet of torque guys now if you jump onto the performance rs and sports tech trims you are going to get a new naturally aspirated bigger engine that will touch on in the nine changes that they've made that has been introduced in certain versions of the subaru cross trek since 2021 and the good news is that all trims feature symmetrical full-time all-wheel drive. Kindly take note that the manual transmission option was discontinued last year. And so we are left with only the Lineatronics TVT as the available choice. And on this particular transmission, when you activate the sport mode, it primarily affects the engine speed between supposed gear changes and doesn't significantly impact on steering and engine sound. And on the matter of engine sound, it remains quite calm, which may disappoint those of you who are into a more aggressive experience, particularly on the RS trim. And the next area that I would like to touch on is in terms of fuel economy, the Impreza delivers respectable numbers within the competition with an estimated rating of 26 miles per gallon in city and 33 miles per gallon on the highway and that gives you a combined 29 mpg it is worth noting that these figures can be improved upon making the impreza a reasonable economical choice in its segment while the cvt may not offer the same level of reliability and performance as the manual transmission we all know it actually compensates for that with the fuel efficiency providing a balance between performance and economy but on this note what's new in the 2024 Subaru Impreza, that is worth your consideration and my consideration. So let's begin with point one. The point one is that we are getting a new trim, which is the RS trim. And this RS trim is equipped with a more powerful 2.5 liter four cylinder engine. And take note of this, it produces 182 horsepower. That's 30 more horsepower over the older engine and 178 pound feet of torque, which is 33 more pound foot of torque over the outgoing uh, or the older engine and this gives the car the ability to effortlessly combine performance and precision people so take notes and it's something you can consider or with your consideration 
the second point that you would like to consider is the fact that the 2024 my model year in Praza is built around safety okay so you get the latest version of eyesight driver assistant technology that comes standard across all the model lineup with its advanced features like the lane keep assist the adaptive cruise control and you will feel an extra layer of confidence and security during the drive but then in federals subaru did not leave any stone unturned because when it comes to safety features there's the inclusion of the automatic emergency steering or the models equipped with blind spot detection lane keep assist and rear cross traffic alert which is a game changer now this advanced system provides an extra layer of protection intervening when necessary to avoid potential pollution so safety is a good one when you are considering the subaru impranza for the year 2024. now the third thing to consider is one that excites all of us one of the most exciting additions to the impranza lineup is the availability of the subaru starlink 11.6 h multimedia plus system yes this one you see that that's the 11.6 inch multimedia plus system and this cutting edge technology brings a new level of connectivity and convenience to your Impreza allowing for seamless control of various features and access to various favorite apps with ease without any hassle people so consider that as well but then what you can add on to that as another consideration is the fourth point which I am so very thrilled I believe you will be is that the 2024 Impranza now offers a wireless Apple CarPlay and an Android Auto for the first time, people. So you can say goodbye or gone are the days of you being tangled with cables and limited mobility in the cabin of your uh, Impranza because now you could effortlessly connect your phone to the car's infotainment system and enjoy a seamless digital experience. I am very much touched with this inclusion, but how about you? Does it make any difference? Put that in the comment section. We'd like to know about that as well. Now, in the heart of it, the fifth point that is worth consideration is that the 2024 model year in Pranza also boasts a 10% stiffer chassis, making this sixth generation a much improved driving vehicle, which greatly enhances the vehicle's dynamic performance and ride quality now when you are driving every twist and turn will feel more controlled and responsive ensuring that you remain glued to the road while enjoying a thrilling driving experience people that is a fifth point to consider as well in this very beautiful revised hatch the sixth point to look at is cabin yes of course you cannot forget the cabin but when you step into the Empress cabin there's a significant reduction in road noise and heightened level of comfort the quieter interior allows you to fully immerse yourself in the driving experience and you appreciate the engine's growl and relishing the absence of outside distraction so that's another thing to consider the road noise the distraction from outside is very much reduced when it comes to this 2024 model e in praza and you haven't forgotten that the manual transmission has been discontinued and so we are left with a seventh point to consider which is a lineatronic cvt that now comes standard on all in praza trim levels and this lineatronic cvt delivers smoother and quieter performance now shifting gears is seamless the impressor effortlessly adapts to your driving style and it provides a seamless and enjoyable ride point number eight the fact that the 2024 subaru impranza draws inspiration from the iconic wrx and the 2024 impranza now features a dual pinion electronic power steering rack when you have that the result is that you get a more direct and natural steering feel that will heighten your connection with a road instilling a sense of confidence and responsiveness with every turn of the wheel guys now then we jump on to the the conclusion the ninth the ninth point to consider and that is the new exterior design that i've already touched on which is simply breathtaking if you have a contrary opinion you can put it in the comment section would like to know why but it has frameless hexagonal grille compact headlights you see that refined body and the impressa exudes a sense of modernity and sophistication in this day and age now the broad shoulder stance further emphasizes a sporty nature turning heads whenever 
or wherever you go. Driving the Impreza will feel like a statement. The attention and appreciation you will garner on the road will say that. When I bring this to a conclusion, let me touch on trims and pricing differences and that may affect your decision making as well. And also answer which of the which of them should be your choice. When it comes to the trims and pricing, we know we are getting three options to consider. The base, the sports and the hours. Now each trim has its own unique features and kits to different preferences and budgets. So let's delve into it, starting with the base. Now on the base trim, we start off at $24,085 at today's current rate. That's 7th of July, 2023. Beyond that, it may vary. The base trim of the Impreza is the most affordable option, guys, aligning with the vehicle's mission of providing a frugal all-wheel drive mode of transportation. While the base model may lack some of the high-end features of the other trims, it offers excellent value for money, we believe. It's a practical choice for those who prioritize functionality and cost-effectiveness. And that is what Subaru brand has been known for and delivering reliable vehicles in that category. Then you jump onto the sport trim, which is the $26,085. That takes you up with about 2000 bucks. And this is priced slightly higher than the base model. The sport trim actually adds a touch of athleticism to the Impreza. It offers sportier styling cues and additional features that enhance its overall appeal. If you are seeking a more dynamic driving experience and desire a sportier appearance, the sport trim could be a great option for you. But then as I top it up, the RS trim, which is the top though, more sportier, is priced at $28,935. Still remember that this is at today's current exchange rate and it may vary beyond this date with its chassis tuning that allows for energetic driving on the canyon roads and a larger 2.5 liter engine it offers a notable performance boost over the base model and if you want value for pricing you may want to stick with the base model as we've earlier stated but then the base trim might be the most sensible choice for buyers focused on practicality and cost effectiveness however if you have an interest for sporty vehicles and the nostalgia associated with the rs trim you may find its enhancements with the additional cost of about four thousand dollars thereabout guys so this is what we got for you and we believe it may help your decision making when it comes to 2024 model year subaru impreza Thank you so much and have a good, great day. If you're interested in other hot hot hatches, I do have on the left corner here, the Ford Focus R shift, which may fall in the same category. Thank you. Have a good, great day until mid same time again. Bye-bye.